So I installed the Casta AC 1200 wireless dual bang uh, gigabit router. <clears throat> Inside the box came the router, the ethernet cord, and the um, power cord. Beep beep, move it bud. And a small instructional sticker book. So what you do I had some trouble, so that's why I'm just going to come back and do a shorty. Um, you plug in your router, your power source, your ethernet to the your modem, and your modem modem, we'll call it a modem 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 modem. And then this ethernet goes over here to your laptop. Now I originally was trying to... Um, do this using my phone and I wasn't thinking because this phone here runs on Wi-Fi and that's why I was having so much trouble on the phone because once you get a certain way um, if you had internet prior your phone if it's a Wi-Fi phone you're not going to have it. anyway that's what went wrong here and the other thing that went wrong was I skipped a very important step in my instructions was to make sure you're plugged in from the router to your laptop. And it slipped my mind because the, I already had a, a Wi-Fi uh, network set up, so it totally slipped my mind until I was getting ticked off. So after you plug it in, you open up mycasta.com. And this little box will pop up. Of course, it'll say, at first, it'll say to set your um, router password will be the first one. It'll have two, two. Set it and confirm it. Then you hit the arrow key. Then you come over here. This will be your um, WAN information. I always take a picture of my stuff. Then you go to the next screen is my wireless. I named it Joni's. Um, this one I named for the 2.4 and the 5 gig I put uh, 5G so that I know I put two different passwords in for the 2.4 and for the 5G then you just go ahead if you're changing things you hit save and apply you don't want to do that again if you're not because then everything will shut off and restart and uh, people who are playing games might not be happy so literally, I did have trouble getting to the My Casta website. Um, it kept up, kept coming up that it didn't exist, and then finally it, it showed up. I don't know if it took time for the uh, router to connect to the site or what, but probably 10 minutes in, all of a sudden that site showed up, and I became quite happy. But I had to reset a couple of times because I was having trouble. And instead of just trying to figure out what went wrong, I just reset and started over fresh. Realized that I didn't plug myself in and that this was a Wi-Fi phone. And uh, I was cursing the day that I met Kazda because it was very long. I think I spent 45 minutes before I realized I made a mistake. Um, if you want... Uh, more instructions you can download the user manual online they give the link inside here I think and um, or you can just go to the Costa website and put in your model and then that will come up but um, I'm gonna what we're doing is seeing what our download speeds and our gameplay speeds uh, frame per minute is with the new modem and I will leave a message down below telling you whether or not this was better than our TP uh, link. So I'm hoping it is because our internet, although quite good, is really dragging. So we were trying to figure out why and we're hoping it was just the router was poor. So um, I'll let you know if this is a winner over the TP. Okay, so I hope this helps somebody if you buy this and you're having trouble with setup, you can contact me and I will do my best to help you. Um, 
it's easy and not easy all rolled into one. I'm so sorry to say that, but it is. It's just how it is. It's how it always is. Something that's supposed to be easy is always going to give you trouble just to test your blood pressure. So, um, yeah, if you run into trouble, you can message me, and I usually check my YouTube messages at least. They pop up on my computer screen once a day I look at them because they're all there they pop up on the side and I can't help but to see them so yep if you run into trouble send me a little message and I will try to help you through it um, some of the English in the um, m -m 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 manual is not that great um, it's not terrible but it's just a little off here and there but nothing detrimental to hooking anything up but uh, I'll let you know how it goes. As it's going right now, everybody's got full bars throughout the house, and that's a good thing. Um, I was going to play with the antennas a little bit more, but I'm thinking I'm going to keep them just like they are. I have them splayed out like hands, like fingers. And at this point, that is working quite well. So um, I will let you know how it goes. I get to unhook this one here. That's just the one um, so that we were hard wired for the setup. So, at this point, everything looks good. Like I said, everybody's got full bars. Um, I will know better when my gamer starts gaming tonight. Um, uh, hopefully, I'll, even before I put this review up, I'll know about the frames per minute going on with the gamer. Alright, thanks for watching. Uh, the price is really good, so hopefully, by the way, the price is good. So, um, hopefully this is an awesome router for the price. Okay, goodbye.